One of my heroes is Elon Musk, and one of the reasons for that is because of the way he solves problems. Elon talks about how there are two methods to approach solving a problem. The first is by analogy, where if you have a problem A you're trying to solve, you can compare it to a problem B that you know really well. And then you can transfer some of the strategies and ideas from problem B over to problem A in order to quickly find a solution. And this is what most of us do, but unfortunately it doesn't bring about a lot of innovation because it doesn't require deep understanding of the problem A if you can simply transfer ideas. The second methodology is first principles, which is a physics approach, which takes problem A and breaks it down to its basic constituent parts and analyzes putting them all together and, and how everything fits together and works. By approaching problems this way, your understanding is much greater and your chance to innovate and eliminate you know, waste or, or unnecessary tradition out of a system is amplified. A great example of that is when he was trying to first build a rocket. Uh, he asked how much they cost and NASA said, you know, it's hundreds of millions of dollars. He said, well, that sounds like so much money. And they said, well, that's how much rockets have always costed. He went to the Russians. They wanted to charge him between 60 and 70 million for an old used, you know, missile shell. And he just said, man, they can't, it can't cost this much. So instead, he, he took first principles and analyzed the metal, the fuel, the computer that went into the rocket and came up with a number that was 2% of what he had been quoted. And so he decided to build the rocket himself. By using first principles to analyze problems, we can find much more innovative, capable uh, solutions.